we got one that's short cycling. On low pressure. So we need to stop him. I am in the attic. Fairly decent access. It looks like we got a a Bryant 2008 I did look in the condenser real quick to see if I saw some obvious signs of a leak and there was nothing hmm We are on high. Um, no ma'am, do you? I do. I smell, there's definitely smoke smell in the house. Okay, um, I may have turned it up enough to bring on your heat strips. Oh, okay. okay. Um. Yeah, I definitely smell something. So we have R22 TXV. If something's a 2008 model, it's not a sure thing that it's going to be R22. It might be 410.
gets me is this pan has had water in it recently. Damn. Definitely leaking, but like I said, the pan has had water in it, like the air conditioning has been working. What I saw outside um, would make me believe that this hadn't worked in a while. So. We're going to condemn this coil, but I'm also going, going to look outside because it looks like it has lost a lot of Freon in a short period of time. They just had to put that screw right there where you can't see it. All right, I'm gonna go outside and check it. Short cycling. I fully expected it to be on high head pressure, but it wasn't, it was on low. Not seeing anything obvious down there. No signs of oil.
Picking up a little something down there. There's a leak on my accumulator, it's really small. Why am I not repeating on any of these? There we go. Not seeing anything. That's enough of a positive hit. I think this is fixing to be a change out. All right, on that one, it looks like that's the second time I have found leaks in that evaporator coil. I think we gave them an estimate to replace the coil a year or two ago and I just quoted the price on this it's, it's a three and a half ton heat pump split and uh, I keep find, I keep finding myself surprised at the price of this equipment it's going up I think my prices on equipment have gone up three or four times already this year and normally they go up just once a year all you can do is pass it along to your customers thanks for watching